Yo, I'm back again, and this time we're going to be doing a Palmer player ratings. So, big up ODW for the recommendation. Um, so let's get straight into it. So, owner loves the club nickname Crocchiati. Um, they're not in Europa League or Champions League. They've been in the league for quite a while. Then they got relegated, then promoted again. Then they got relegated all the way down to flipping Serie D, bruv. Then to Serie C, then B, then back to A, bruv. Then they've been just floating around, fam. So let's get into it now, Palmer. All right, so um, we're going to be going from the goalkeeper all the way to the um, Javinho, bruv. Flipping, I'm they got Javinho. Wow, so... Let's just get straight into it, fam. So, Simon Colombi. All right. So, 29, back up. All right. So, trying to see goalkeeper defend. All right. Now, I can see why. Because he's got four passing and 13 kicking. So, he has to be on defend. But let's see. Can he actually defend, though? Six foot two, 13 agility, 15 reflexes, 14 one on ones. Um, communications, that's good. Error reach 14. Jump and reach 13. Um, he can slightly. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna knock him off. I'm not gonna lie to you, bruv. He can slightly defend, fam. Just a little bit, fam. You get me? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Nothing nothing special though. So he has to be back up, fam. You know, it's not that deep where you have to go out and buy another backup keeper, but you can do his thing. That's what matters, fam. Anyway, um next, Luigi Seppe. Heard of this guy. Um, backup and goalkeeper same age so that's always a good thing you get me you don't want one 39 year old backup fam you know if he pulls one ligament then it's game over bruv so keep keep Luigi Seppe as your first choice um, he's also a goalkeeper defend these men have got the right idea fam but at least they're not trying to force it with the sweeper keeper thing they know their position bruv safe anyway reflex is 16 15 one on ones you can't go wrong fam he's 6 foot 1 though for a keeper it's quite poor fam, not gonna lie to you. Um 14 agility. That's baseline as well. Um aerial reach 13. But jumper reach 14. I don't get this jumper reach and aerial reach. Maybe that's how much how far he can stretch his arms, fam. And that's how high he can jump. So it might make sense now. Um 15 handling, that's always good. Overall, in terms of goalkeeper defend, he can do his thing. However, you may concede a couple bangers, fam. I'm not gonna lie, because a man's got he's six foot one. And 14, 14 jumping reach is not the greatest, I'm not going to lie to you. So, you know, um, how can I say it? He, he might get packed in the bin, like top bins. That's what I'm trying to say. So, Luigi Giuseppe, he's a good keeper though. Um, so, going on to the centre-backs now, Bruno Alves. Um, now, have I heard of this guy? I haven't, but he's 38, bruv. He's 38, so... Let's see, you can see, he's got 10 pace, 10 agility, 7 acceleration. 13 tackling, ball playing defender with 10 technique, 12 vision and 14 passing. So he can kind of do it, he can do it still. 15 composure, 17 heading, 16 jumping reach, he's 6 foot 2, 16 strength. 20 natural fitness, that's why he's still playing. That's why he's still playing. And 20 determination as well. Um, Alright, this guy now, he's... I'm not going to lie, he's not even that bad. For a 38 year old, he's not even that bad, you know. I just fear that he's going to get absolutely flipping skinned, bruv. He's going to get absolutely skinned, fam. The way men are going to be moving to this guy, in terms of if they kick the ball at him and run away from him, it's going to take him, like, quite a long time, bruv. He's, he's not keeping up, that's what I'm trying to say. But in terms of defending, put someone like this in the back three. That way you get the strengths out of them because then they won't be exploited, fam. So, play to the strengths, bruv. You get me? Um, he has a lot of traits as well. He's very experienced. Where's he been? Where's this guy been? Um, Porto, Gamirez, Port Porto again, um, Zenit, Fenerbahce. So, he's been about. He's been about still. Um, he, he's been about still. So, that's Bruno Alves still. So, next, Latoro Valenti. Um... Young centre back. Oh, he's loaned but joining permanently. That's good. All right. Now, for a 21 year old, 14 tackling is really good. 13 pace is good. 14 acceleration good. However, 11 agility, you need to fix up firm because you're only 6 foot 2. 16 strength, though. 
So that's also really good for a 21 year old, not going to lie to you. Um, fighting composure as well. Um, overall, though, I'm trying to think, fam. He's, he's okay, he's, he's quite promising. Um, he's, he's got potential there. Is he ball playing? 10 technique, 9 vision, 13 passing. Not really, I can't lie. He's not really ball playing. Not not with not with a pivot like that. I can't lie. So play to the strengths, bruv. Another person that you put in the back three, fam. Like these men, they can be got at. I'm not gonna lie to you. But however, he's only 21, so you can give him the benefit of the doubt, bruv. You can. Um. So overall, he's a decent development player. So that's Latoura Valenti still. All right. Cool. Next, Andrea Di Maggio, fam. Jesus Christ. Oh my goodness. Get, fam. Fam. You're only 20, fam. I get it, I get it, I get it. You're 20, innit? I get that. But, bruv, you can't be this bad, fam. You can't be this bad. He's so bad, bro. How many, how many greys does he have compared to the flipping yellow or oranges, bruv? He's so bad. If you, if I deep these stats, fam, do you know what man are going to be, do you know what man are going to be doing to this guy, fam? You're 20, but I advise you retire now. Not going to lie to you. I have to be completely honest, fam. This this sport is not for you. You're in the wrong field, my G. Can't lie, fam. What what is he gonna improve? Oh, the se- the pace can go up to ten. The the strength can go up to ten as well. <laughs> hey, shit, I can't lie. Get me off this card. Next, your Dan Osorio. Yeah, these men have to play a five at the back still. Their defense is shocking, fam. I can't lie. Man's got a thirty eight year old boss in the thing, fam. <laughs> I can't lie. These men defense is shocking, bruv. All right, cool. 11 agility, 11 acceleration, fam. All right, 12 pace and 13 strength for a centre back. That's awful physical, it's awful, awful, fam. Um, he's got he's ball playing defender. He's got a pivot of 13 technique, 8 vision, 12 pass. They're not the end of the world. That's not the end of the world. 13 tackling as well, um, with 12 composure and 13 decisions could mean penalties, bruv. I'm not gonna lie, these men are vulnerable. They can be got at, bro. If one of them, if one of these men get injured and you're bringing in man like flipping non football off the bench, bruv, gonna get packed so many times. It's peak fam. It's not worth it. These guys, overall as a defense, they're shit. In terms of the centre backs, hopefully the wing backs can really like pull something out the bag for these guys. Because currently it's game over fam. Currently it's peak bruv. So that's Jordan Osorio bruv. All right, on onto the onto the full backs now. All right, Maxim Busi. Come on. Wow. All right. You know what? Because he's 20, I'll allow him. Um, in terms of there's actually something to hold on to, fam, because he's actually got a couple oranges. Like, all right, now, what kind of player? They say wing back support. With 11 dribbling and 12 crossing, who are you supporting? Um, that's why I always say he's got 11 composure, 11 tackling, 14 pace, 12 agility. For, uh, yeah, he's kind of dead. I can't lie. He's rubbish, fam. I can't lie. He, he's rubbish. He's rubbish. Um. Even if he does improve, he's still rubbish. I can't lie. Like, what was the tackling? 12, 12, 13. That's when it's going to go up to flipping. Um, I don't know. The pivot, 11 technique, 8 vision, 10 passing. Another non footballer, fam. This guy's rubbish. I can't lie. Let me get away from it as well. Next, Vincent Larini, fam. All right. There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. 15 pace, 14 agility. I mean, 14 acceleration, 13 agility, 12 balance. 12 strength, 14 tackling, 11 dribbling, 13 crossing. Fullback attack, who are you attacking with 11 dribbling? Don't get me wrong, you can still carry the ball. Nine flare, that, that's not good. Got decent um, mentals at the top though, um, in terms of the de- determination, decision, concentration, composure. Um, not really the greatest, but for, for someone that I don't want in the box, then again, he might have to be in the box because he's better tackling than defending. But then again, he's called a fullback attack, so it don't make sense. It's another flipping contradiction, bruv. These men don't make sense, bruv. They don't make sense. How many times am I going to catch them out? How many times am I going to catch these guys out, fam? 14 tackling, but he's on fullback attack when he's got 11 dribbling and 13 crossing. Safe. Dumb. Anyway, 30, 30, he's 31. Not going to improve. Keep him in the back. Just let him defend in it because you're going to have to let, fam. He's going to have to tuck in. He's going to have to tuck in a player that's almost like a, a fourth centre-back fam. Because these men can't defend. 14 tackling. You're going to have to do it still. So that's flipping Larini next. Simon Lacoponi. Um, that's a sick name. Anyway, um, 
All right, I see that composure straight away. Needed. Wait, this guy's another defender. But I thought they said he's a right back. You know what? He's playing centre back for me because thank God, fam. He has to play centre back. We're, we're relying on these men that are 31 plus, you know. That's how bad it's getting. Cool. So, got decent physicals for a, for a 33 year old, fam. I'm surprised his um, natural fitness isn't higher than that. So, very vulnerable to getting ligament damage, fam. You know, the ones there. All right, 14 strength. 13 pace, 12 agility, 12 acceleration, fam. Decent. 433 year old anyway. He's got a pivot of 11 technique, 12 vision, 13 passing. Just got better and better, fam. Um, not, not gonna take the piss out of that. Because at least he can do it, fam. At least he can do it. He's trying, fam. Alright, he can cross. That's that's part of him playing right back. I'll keep him as a ball playing defender though. Because the man's got 16 composure. So it's kind of press resistant, kind of. Can't really dribble his way out, but you know. Decent pivot, um, kind of pass, and he can win the ball at least, fam. At least he can't really position himself that well, and he's got better off the ball than his position, so can get caught out. Another person you put in the back three, but at least he can kind of defend them. So put him. That's that's the strengths. Um, one of the best centre back cards that I've seen in this team. So definitely use him still as a centre back, fam. Not a right back, centre back. Um, Damian used to play for these man. Flip it now. Um, all right, cool. Next, who's that? Ricardo Gag Gagliolo. Ricardo Gagliolo. All right, next. Whoa, man, Swedish fam. And you, okay, man. <laughs> wow, <laughs> did he change it? <laughs> fam, man, Swedish, and he's got an Italian name. That's funny. I can't lie. That's very funny, fam. Anyway, cool. So, thirteen pace. 14 agility, 16 stamina, 15 strength, physicals are unlocked, can't lie to you. Another person, you're not playing that wide, you're playing centre back. We need you. I can't lie. We need you, fam. We need you still. 15 composure, 15 tackling. I can't lie. The fullbacks have saved the thing. 14 jump reach, 14 heading. Two of these fullbacks, you know what? In the back three, th those two fullbacks that I've just gone through, this guy and the one that I just went through, and one of those that that 38 year old defender, that's a decent back three, you know. That's a decent back three. You're not gonna concede too many with that, I'm not gonna lie to you. 15 tackling, pivot of 9 technique, 10 vision, 13 passing. So yeah, at least he can pass, you know, the ones there. But he's not. A, he's got dead technique and dead vision. So if he gets pressed though, 15 composure, kind of, it can kind of help him though, it can. Um, 15 work rate, 14 crossing, that's from him playing as a left back, left with centre back fam. You're playing as a centre back for me, not going to lie. 15 strength as well. Overall, doing his thing as a centre back fam. 15 marking as well, centre back safe anyway next um Gia, Giacomo Giacomo Ricky Ricky 23 um wing back support um 11 dribbling 12 crossing who are you supporting 23 at, he's at that age where he's not a youth player anymore in terms of in about a year or so um emergency backup as you can see 11 composure 12 tackling 11 decisions so that's just penalties keep him away from the box but if you do keep him away from the box he hasn't really got anything off it going forward fam so you're fucked either way not gonna lie um for me he's getting sold he's valued at 400k he's not good enough i can't lie he's not good enough in it it's not good enough so let's keep it swift with that one next giuseppe pezzella all right um wing back support no full back attack full back attack um 11 dribbling 12 crossing who are you attacking fam who are you attacking i can't lie um 15 pace 15 acceleration at least he can bomb forward though but on an 11 dribbling thing just gonna get the ball it's gonna it's just gonna be bouncing all over the place with 11 first touch as well he's at least he can go forward in terms of pace though do i trust him to get back with 13 tackling he can defend better than he can flip and go forward another contradiction fam it don't make no sense bruv However, I have seen in this game, man with dead crossing whip the ball the best. I can't lie. They always do in it. So um overall I'll definitely use him though. He's six foot two, so he's a big winger. He's got pace. Um like I said, the eleven dribbling is quite poor. Just train him to dribble. I clocked he's only twenty two. Train him to dribble, then you you've got a player on your hands, fam. So that's Giuseppe Pezzella still, baller. Um in terms of if you train him to dribble, then I can send him then I can say he's a baller still. So you already know. Next, her nanny. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we keep it PG, bruv. You know the ones there. We keep it PG, fam. 
No, no dirty jokes. Anyway, um, all right, box to box midfielder, um, pivot of fourteen technique, eleven vision, fourteen passing. That's that's an okay pivot. You can't see. Get get some glasses, bro. Um, thirteen pace, twelve twelve acceleration, twelve agility. Can't but can move at the same time. Either footed as well, so he's quite unpredictable in terms of they don't know what foot he's going to use. Twelve dribbling, definitely box to box because he's got good tackling and good passing. So he's definitely box to box. So. That's a good box to box, not gonna lie. Work rate quite low, but aggression quite low as well. But work rate's baseline, so I'll allow him still. And he's got composure, definitely box to box. You know what you're gonna get minimum sixes out of tens, you know? Do his thing, still do his thing. So that's that guy. <laughs> I'm not gonna say his name again. Flipping next Matteo Scozzarella. <laughs> Scozzarella. Why why have they transfer listed him? Fam, you need him, bruv. He's not even that bad. I can't lie. He's not even that bad, fam. Box to box again. Tackling 14, passing 13. So, you already know. 18 determination. Fam, he's, he's just, he's just, he's just going to be a guy that's just going to do his job, fam. He's just going to get his job done. I don't know why you don't need him. You definitely need him. Someone that can de get their job done. Not going to fuck around with different skills and that just lose the ball, bang it into dead ends. Like, just tell him. Keep it simple. Keep it short. Do your job, fam. You get me? Um... He's already considering to retire, but fam, keep him in it. 11 composure though. Sell him, sell him, sell him, sell him. <laughs> I'm joking now. Nah, keep him, still keep him. All right, cool. Next, um, Alberto Grassi. All right, so 13 technique, 13 vision, 13 passing. That's a decent pivot. Another box to box fam. Flipping how? Where's the diversity fam? You man, you man are just so one dimensional. Anyway, 15 tackling, 13 passing. So box to box kind of in it. Not a destroyer. He hasn't got the work rate to be a destroyer. Um, 13 passing, 13. He can kind of move. He can. Um, he can kind of move still. Out of all the box to boxes, I'll probably. 25. Um, I don't know, man. At least he can win the ball, though. So maybe you do have to use him more defensively. But then again, got he's got 12 composure, man. So he can't really dictate the ball. And his passing isn't even that great either. Maybe a defensive midfielder, you know? Maybe. But not a destroyer, though. Like maybe a deeper version of a box to box, you know, so just box to box, but keep him like short passing. You get me? Um, yeah, fourteen flare though. That's 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 a mad one. Um, overall, he's kind he's kind of weird. He in some areas I'm like this guy shit, but in some areas I'm like you know he's actually not that bad, fam. So Alberto Grassi, you fucked up my head, fam. I can't lie, but do do your thing, man. Um, I I would keep him still. So I'll keep him. Anyway, um, next. Giuseppe Car Carriero, Carriero, another box to box flipping out. What is, what's this man's problem, bruv? And this guy is rubbish as well. Like 13 tackling, 12 passing, fam. At least he's only 22, but still, fam. Come on now, come on, come on, come on, fam. Like 11 dribbling, bruv. 14 technique, 12 vision, 12 passing to get me off this card. You, you know what? Because he's 22, I have to allow him because he's actually got more oranges than he's got greys. So I'll allow him in it. Um, that, you know what, that tackling, if that does go up to about 40 and if that passing goes up to 30, then he'll just be like the rest of them. Just a decent box to box. He's got 10 balance. So as I speak, he needs support from crutches or something. Um, at 10 acceleration as well. So it's going to get him quite a while to get to 13 pace, fam. Why? Why do you need to wait a long time to get to 13 pace? What's the point, fam? Anyway, that's, and that's Giuseppe Carriero still. Next is Juraj Kuka. Another box to box fam. These men are so one dimensional. It's mad fam. Another person you're going to have to wait quite a long time to get to 13 pace. What's the point fam? What is the point? All right, now play to the strengths now. 13 technique, 12 vision, 14 passing. That's a decent pivot with 13 tackling as well. So he can definitely win and distribute the ball. 15 long shots with 13 decisions is never a good thing because all it's going to mean is that he's going to be banging the ball into dead ends. You don't want that fam. So what you want. Use that 15 strength and that 14 passing. Let him be a little bit of a terrier in the midfield, you get me? Just break up the play. But then again, he's got 13 tackling, so you can't really break up the play. Just use your physical presence in the midfield and pass the ball. That's all I want you to do, fam. Not going to lie. At least you've got composure as well. 12 dribbling. Kind of. Kind of dribble. Kind of. Not not really, but kind of. 18 natural fitness, 16 determination, 17 bravery. Another box to box, but he's slightly better than the other one. So, got to keep him still. Um... Do I, uh, for some reason you can play Cam You're not playing Cam G Not going to lie to you You can't even finish bruv And your pivot isn't even Cam Cam worthy bruv So 
It's know your position, bruv. Know your position. All right, cool. Next, Gaston Bragman. Another box. You fam, these men are taking the piss. I can't lie to you. 27. Um, 13 tackling, 14 passing, another box to box. But then again, he's got a good pivot. So you know what? As it stands, you're playing further forward. Can't lie to you. But then again, you've got 10 composure. So you can't, fam. Why do you have to fucking let me down like this, bruv? And you're 27, so you're not even going to improve as well. But credit, credit, where credit, credit. Credit where credit's due, 14 technique, 14 vision, and 14 passing. That's actually a really good pivot still. Um, he can move the ball well, dictates tempo as well. But how are you dictating tempo with 10 composure? Because dictating tempo means that you're going to dwell on the ball, and you've got a trait for that as well. But if you do dwell on the ball and you get pressed with 10 composure, then you're going to free up the ball. Like some dickhead, fam. So what's the point, bruv? What's the point? Just contradicting yourself once again, fam. Don't make no sense, bruv. He can play DM, he can play centre mid, slightly play cam. For me, just put him centre mid. He could do both in it. Box to box, but I'll actually like play this box to box. Um, ten composure though. Um, but we're we're gonna have to try and, you know, if if we can train, just target ten composure on some double intensity thing. If he gets injured and his career's over, it's worth it. It's worth it. It's worth it still. So, um, Gaston Brugman, decent, cool. Next, William Cyprian. Thank God, he's a Mazella. Um, 14 technique, 13 vision, 15 passing. Decent pivot. All right, now he can slightly move with 15 acceleration and 14 agility. He can move. 13 pace, not really fast though. Now, 12 strength, not the greatest. Um, 13 composure, 16 work rate, 10 tackling. Now, he's got 13 decisions, but 16 long shots. Um... The thing I always say, will I make that loan move permanent? It's not worth it. They've got too many box to boxes. I get it, he's a Mazella, but his pivot isn't even Mazella worthy anyway. So you're not really gonna miss anything. He's 25. Fam, you're not you're not gonna miss anything with this guy. His, his media description is a defensive mid midfielder, but he's got 10 tackling, bruv. Once again, contradicting the thing. Um T dictates tempo with 13 composure. Comes deep to get the ball. Um you know what? Don't don't make that loan move permanent. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So that's Cyprian still. Next, Matteo Lixau. <laughs> I don't even know. Hey, he's so bad, you know. He's so bad. Hey, he's shit for him. I can't lie. He's rubbish for him. He's rubbish still. Um, he's 19, 10 technique, 7 vision, 11 passing. And you're meant to be a midfielder. You're going to get eaten alive, bro. You're going to get eaten alive, fam. I get it. In what, 19? He's got about four years to improve these stats. Do I see them getting far? Not really. What, what? Let's imagine all of them go up by like one or two. It's still a shit card, fam. So, dead, fam. Rubbish. Next, Vincenzo Mustachi. Mustach <laughs> Vin Vincenzo Mustachiolo. Flipping out. Another dead player. I can't lie, he's rubbish, fam. Rubbish. We're not even gonna waste time. He's rubbish. He's rubbish still. He's rubbish. Um, next, Jacopo Desi. Um, now he's he's decent, but he's twenty eight. I would expect those stats to be a twenty one year old or at least nineteen eighteen. So for considering your age, can't lie. You you you're you're meant to be a guy that's a deep playing playmaker. Can you dictate the ball? You haven't got the trait to get it. Um, you've got 12 composure, your pivot's 14 technique, 14 vision, about 13 passing, so it's decent, but not the greatest, bruv. Um, first touch, 13, bubbling all around the place. Oh, he's got a hand in pretty much every pond, but he can't do it well, so don't waste your time. Um, I can understand why these men have all those box-to-boxes now, considering the other midfielders, but let's hopefully there's a saviour, there's a creator, hopefully. My goodness me, another dead midfielder, but then again... He's, he's, I get it, he's young like the rest of them, but at least he's got potential, fam. Like, there's, there's one thing being young and no potential, and there's another thing being young with potential. If you're young with no potential, then save your career, stick to school or something. You know, you're not a footballer, fam. But this guy, on loan from Juventus, um, got the pace, slight agility, no balance, 10 technique. He's a winger, though. He's a winger and a centre midfielder. That make no, fam. He's, he's, uh, you know what, he's rubbish. I can't lie, he's rubbish. He's rubbish still. He's rubbish. I have to be completely honest. 13 technique, 13 vision, 12 passing, but still. 12, 11 composure. Now nah, he's rubbish still. He's rubbish. All right. Um, 
Next, um, who was it? Is it him? Is it, wait, who was it? Oh yeah, it's him, it's him, it's him. All right, so. Um, wait, 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 wait. I saw we've done this guy already. Yeah, it's Jasmine Kurtich next. Um, he's quite reminiscent to the other guy. Um, the other box to box. Uh, it's got to be questioning if it's the same person from. I can't even remember. Funny technique, fourteen vision, fifteen passing. So at least he can he can distribute the ball. He he's the the box to box. Like out of all of them, I think he's the best one still. Got the strength. He can't move though. That's the problem. Box to boxes are meant to be be able to move. He can barely move, bruv. You're stiff, bruv. We need some oil up in here, fam. Flipping hell, mate. Anyway, thirteen dribbling, thirteen finishing. Get in the box and score. Like I said, he's got composure, determined. Off the ball movement is sound as well, mate. He can pass the ball. Overall, he's a good boxer box fam. He's a good boxer box. He is. 15 long shots as well. What's the decisions? 13. Um, you know what? I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. I think he's the best mid um best boxer box still. I think he is. Alright, so that's Jasmine Kurtic. Next is Juan Brianata. He's 23, he's meant to be a cam. So what's your pivot? 15 technique, 14 vision, 14 passing. That's a decent pivot. 23, 14 dribbling, he can pick up the ball and drive, he's got 18 flair, he's got 13 first touch though, 14 composure, that's really good, but 13 first touch, you're, you're letting yourself down, I can't lie, you're meant to be silky, I can see the silky potential, but then again, with 13 first touch, bouncing all over the place, he can get in the box and score, he's got good dribbling, he's got good flair, overall, he's okay, as a creator, I would put him in the midfield, Considering that they don't have any other creators so far, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to be the main creator right now. That's what it's looking like, fam. Um, he's on loan, gonna have to make it permanent. So far, so far you're gonna have to make it permanent. Still, so far, so that's Juan Brunetta, fam. Um, mad thing. Next, Mattia Sprocati. All right. Um, I have a footed. He's got. 13 pace for in agility for in acceleration no composure he can get in the box and s score a little bit but he's meant to be out wide he's rubbish fam he's rubbish I can't lie he's rubbish fam I can't lie he's rubbish fam he is um, you're meant to be a winger can barely barely move dead dribbling or average he's just, he's just average but bad a bad version of average, so he's averagely poor. That's what I'm trying to say. Not worth your time, not gonna lie to you. Next, Valentin. I'm not even gonna attempt to say that second name. And I'm not even gonna attempt to get into this card because he's quite bad, fam. He can move, and that's about it. Like, I get it, he's 20, so I can kind of allow him. Kind of, you know what? I'll kind of allow him. 12 technique, 9 vision, 11 passing. Hopefully, in three years, you know, that's that's all you've got to improve. Considering the game time you get, you you need to improve, boy. Cause man's a winger with ten first touch. My lord, fam, getting me off this card. Can't lie. Next, Andrea Odorante. Wow. All right. You know what? He's young, so I can allow him. Six foot can barely move. He's very determined. He can get in the box, and you're gonna have to give him service upon service upon service for him to get any decent amount of goal contributions in terms of scoring, fam. Like, pressing forward, 14 work rate, I'll allow you. 11 aggression, not the greatest. Um, 12 first touch, but 13 finishing for a striker. He's only 20, so I can kind of allow him. I'll kind of allow him still, kind of. So, that's Andrea Adolante. I'll allow him, fam. Cool. So, saving Javinho. Next, Jan Cadamo. 15, 15 pace, 17 deliberation. That's what caught my eye first. So, thank God he's 22. And we can work on this guy. We can work on him. Thank God. All right. So he's got a bit of pace now. He can play striker as well. Um, thank you. Um, he can play striker as well. So 11 strength, um, 15 dribbling. So if you put him striker, he'll be creating his own chances. He can barely finish, but at least he's got a little bit of composure, though, for a 22-year-old. Um, rubbish pivot, though. 14 technique, 11 vision, 12 passing. Um, 11, 11 vision, you can't see. You can barely pass the ball. Got a bit of unpredictability with the flair. Um, thank you. Um, twelve finishing can slight. Now nah, you know he can't. He can't really shoot. Still, you need to train him to shoot. And he's got ten stamina at that age. That's never a good thing. 
that's never a good thing. I can't lie, that's never a good thing. What, 30 minutes and you're going to have to hook him off already? It's not worth it, fam. Can't lie. That means you're basically a super sub then. That's all I see you as now. Um, you're not a starter anymore. Can't lie. Regular starter? Not for me. Maybe for you, though. Winger on attack. Um, overall, maybe. Um, you know what? Yeah, super sub. Super sub. That's what he's going to have to be still. Super sub. Um, next, Andreas Cornelius. Striker. All right. Thank God he can shoot. My goodness me. Plays his shots. Come deep to get the ball. Tries first time shots. All right. So, let me see now. Um, target man on support. 15 technique, 12 vision, 13 passing. He can kind of support the thing. He's got 13 composure as well. First touch, 13. 18 strength. That's really good. I can't lie. Six foot four with 17 champion reach and 16 heading. So, he's going to be a problem in the air, fam gonna be a problem in the air still um loan from atlanta join him permanently so yeah keep that one permanent keep it permanent still he works hard he can get in the box and score for him he plays he doesn't even play with back to goal so he's got 10 agility though i didn't even see that 10 agility so keep him you know in that like in the middle let man like flipping javinio bounce off him and that that's what you're gonna have to do um so overall He's a decent target, man. Can't lie. Got the physical presence that you need for a man like Javino and and that other pace pace guy. You need you need you need this guy to you know accommodate that pace. You always need someone like this, someone that can um, what's it called? Be like a magnet for the centre backs. Draw them in, fam. That's all you need. So yeah, that's Andreas Cornelius. So all right. Um, next Roberto Inglese, fam. All right. Um, another pressing forward he's got 17 work rate so that's really good um, 13 pace 14 acceleration 15 strength that's good as well and he's got 15 finishing two strikers with 15 finishing that's that's always a good thing always a good thing he's got 16 off the ball he's looking quite dynamic he's not really fast though that's the only thing in the air 15 jumper reach 14 heading these men are good in the air there's two big big goalkeepers but he's got the other one's trait though he plays with his back to goal doesn't really make sense as a pressing forward you don't, you don't really play with your back to go over pressing forward that don't make no sense but he's got a pivot of 14 technique 13 vision and 13, and 12 passing which is a good thing um, like I said in the air he's not that bad and he can get in the box and shoot can't create his own chances but at least if you do give him chances he can finish them off overall good player for him he's a good good striker still but you're going to have to wait 3 months for him um, yeah so overall decent still next and finally, Javinho fam. The reunion fam. Let's see what you've been up to, Maji. Um, I'm not even going to say Maji. Don't really like you. You remind me a bit like flipping. I'm not even going to say it. I'm not going to say it, but let's see. All right, so he's still got his pace. At the age of 33, he's still got his pace. That's always a good thing. That's always a good thing. Um, I, I need some of that, that, that shit that you're on to keep your pace at the age of 33. That's really good. So 18 pace and 18 acceleration. That's that's really good still. 15 agility, so he's moving, guys. He's moving, guys. Um, Basically, he's just pure pace, fam. Raw pace, like. 16 flair as well. So, maybe he, he could actually be a problem. I can't lie. 16 flair, 17 determination, 14 dribbling, that's baseline. 13 finishing, he can kind of shoot. Um, you, you, you want to play to this guy's strengths I'll, I'll get on to that in a minute 15, 15 technique, 13 vision, 13 passing now, to play to his strengths he's just one of those wingers basically that you know, you know how they're, they're just pure pace and their pace kind of just fucks up everything else in terms of like playing football fam, like how, how can I say it, because they're so fast yeah, it fucks up their other, their other attributes bruv like that's why he's got 9 composure fam because he can't slow down in time and the ball's just all over the place with 13 first touch, bruv. You know, I'm trying to think. You need someone like that, those target men in front of him, so that they can kind of slow it down for him. Then he can bang it. I can imagine he shoots with power because his technique, you know, his technique isn't even that bad, you know. Can he play shots? Nah. Um, but you know what? He's genuinely, he's a, he's a weird one still. 33. Play to the strengths, bruv. You get me? Um, flipping nine composure. That's just service, bruv. Just give him a lot of service. He can kind of do his thing in this team anyway. One of their best players, I can't lie. He is one of their players, best players. So, inverted winger or striker, though. Now, 
You can play him striker, according to this game. As a trequista, no. Put him as a like, poacher or something where he just sits on the last line of the defence. Looks to get him behind, fam. That's all you want him to do. You don't want him linking play. You don't want him doing that, not going to lie. Um, now, if you play him in a two-striker formation with one, one of those brutes, yeah, with bare strength next to him, they can do a thing still. They can definitely do a thing in this league, especially in this league. Definitely do a thing. So, overall, you, man. Um... Let's get into the areas to improve. My goodness me. Um, I, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to keep it 100% with you, man. I will be here all day if I do it areas to improve. Because to my standards, fam, I can't lie. I might have to lower them a bit and be equal, fam. So, um, centre-backs, Lord have mercy. Man's having to play flipping right-backs and left-backs in centre-back positions. Because there's, all that means is you're going to have to buy right-backs, left-backs, Actual right backs and left backs because the ones that you've got they're gonna have to be playing centre back still. So a lot of those centre backs play a back three. Gonna have to buy a right winger depending on what formation you use. Then again, you can play with just strikers in it. You can. Um, overall, um, what rating would I give them out of five? Um, getting a two and a half still. Getting a two and a half. Um, I think that's fair enough. So overall, you man, make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe to the video. Shout out ODW again for the recommendation. Um, you man always, always ask me stuff in the comments. I always respond, you get me? So a lot, a lot more of the videos are coming out now anyway. So I'll see you in my next episode.